happen? We have the answer. Good evening and thank you for joining us tonight for Eyewitness News at 11. I'm Shelby Pay. More details have come out regarding the murder-suicide that occurred last night in North Utica. Police received the first call just before 7.30 last night and responded to the 400 block of Kingston Road, just off Riverside Drive. The first officer to arrive encountered a male outside with a long gun and another person on the ground with shotgun wounds. The male with the rifle fired two shots at the responding officer and then ran into a neighboring home. The officer followed the shooter and then ran into the residents of that home, who told the police that the man with a gun had shot himself. Other responding police entered the first house they were called to and found a woman with multiple gunshot wounds deceased. They also found a two-year-old child unharmed. The child was given over to family members at the scene. Now there was also another man involved, though. That's the grandfather of the shooter, who sustained a gunshot wound to his leg. He was treated at Wynn Hospital for a non-life-threatening injury. Police learned that the deceased man and woman had been in a previous relationship and they were the parents of the child. The identities of those involved have not yet been released, but when they are, we will not be reporting them out of respect to the family. The investigation continues. And on Tuesday,